make coconut yogurt out of fresh coconut. So I'm gonna show you guys how I make the coconut yogurt because it's something I eat every single day. When I started being very conscious about what I was putting in my body, that even things that we think are organic yogurts or plant-based milk, um, they still have so much stuff in it that I, we shouldn't be, am I, I, I don't want to consume. <laughs> my name is Jordan, and for the last nine years, I've been living for what many might have looked like a dream. I was a real estate broker in one of the fastest growing cities of America, but for some reason could just never quite find happiness. After being diagnosed with a rare, incurable eye disease that oftentimes leads to blindness, I decided now more than ever is a time for me to follow my true dreams, which is to see the world. So I packed up my bags, packed up my home, and bought a one-way ticket across the world. During my solo travels, I rediscovered a new meaning for life and found that there was hope for me to heal my own body. I am so excited that you're joining me on this journey as I rediscover me and find that this diagnosis was the best thing that ever happened to me. <laughs> you can hear it in the coconut water in here. So the first thing that you have to do when making coconut yogurt is we have to drain the water the coconut milk, the water, whatever it is, you have to drain the liquid out of the coconut. So what you'll find is that there are like three little dot things, holes, I don't really know what to call them, um, but they're in the bottom of every coconut. These ones are kind of faint, but they're at the bottom of every coconut. And basically, one of them is soft, so you just have to poke at, you just have to poke at all of these until you find the soft one, and then it will allow you to go all the way through. So I'm using actually something like this. Uh, they do sell like coconut open, opening kits on Amazon for like $25. I just haven't bought one. Um, but really anything that you can stick all the way through is going to be ideal. This is all of the coconut juice, water, milk, whatever, that came out of four coconuts. So I'm gonna keep this for tomorrow when I make the coconut yogurt because you need some kind of liquid to mix in when you start blending it. Put the coconuts in bags and I'm gonna freeze them now, so yeah. Okay, so it's day two of coconut making. So I just got these out of the freezer. So now I'm going to try to bust these open. So you can see this edge of coconut meat. Can you? Yeah, you can see this edge of coconut meat. So now to get the shell off. So the hardest part about making the coconut yogurt is just like getting the coconut out of the shell. So this process is messy, really messy, but it is so worth it. So now that we got the coconuts open and we got them all like peeled, now we're gonna make the coconut yogurt. So I'm just using maple syrup, coconut sugar, live probiotics, and cinnamon and coconut water. So this is everything that's needed to do this. Now that I've gotten it out of the shell, I'm just gonna cut this up into smaller pieces so that it's a little bit easier to blend. I'm going to dump some coconut water in here also so that it's easier to blend. You'll notice on all of my videos, I'm very just like 
do what feels good. So I don't really ever measure anything. The sugar, the maple syrup, the water, the cinnamon, nothing. I just kind of like throw it in there and go for the best. So it's been like 48 hours and I am getting my yogurt out of the oven because it's fermented now. So yeah, so now it's done. Um, I did have kind of like an issue. Um, you're supposed to kind of leave these jars like slightly open um, because I guess air gets into them when, you st when it starts fermenting. So basically I did it, I shut these completely and when I opened it, it exploded everywhere. So definitely make sure to kind of leave the jars kind of slightly open whenever you leave it in there. Um, yeah, so now I have my coconut yogurt and I've been eating my fruit bowl with my coconut yogurt. So that is exactly how you make it and um, <laughs> yeah.